Hello and welcome back to Microsoft Flight Simulator. We are on the runway ready for takeoff at Williamsburg, Whitley County uh, Airport in Kentucky. Uh, Southeastern Kentucky. <laughs> so we are at, let's see, we are 1,200 feet. Come on plane, you need to get up there. There you go. We've got a uh, request to fly around Jellico and possibly even Williamsburg here. Uh, they're pretty close together, about uh, 10 miles apart, so we'll get some altitude here. Okay, let's lose a flap. Whoop, there we go. Oh, we got a river right away. We got a river right away, and I wish I would have looked. I, maybe it's Mars River. I, I checked it out, but uh, now I forget. All right, well, we're going to do an orbit around the airport first here. Let's see, it is 10.40 in the morning. It's actually <laughs> 1 o'clock in the morning for me. that airport right there there we go Williamsburg uh, Williamsburg or Whitley County Airport Let's see I took off flying south so that's the way we want to go we want to follow we got to find the interstate interstate 75 and follow it south bit of wind here. Ah, oh. there we go. To the east we have um, larger mountains. I think even Williamsburg is considered the gateway to the Cumberlands. Or the gate to the Cumberlands. Oh, look, there's my shadow on the ground. Uh, the gateway to the Cumberlands. There's that river, man. Um, I'm going to say Marsh River, but uh, I could be wrong. Kentucky. Now, whenever I think of Kentucky, it's usually the horses. They just had the um, Derby, uh, I think, today. And, well, yesterday. It's after midnight. An authentic one. So when I think of Kentucky, I'm going to be looking for horse rings in, in people's backyards and barns and stuff. So I know y'all don't ride, all ride horses. So Okay, there's a couple of small roads. There's a 25. I think that's 25 heading south there. Oh, we got the airport. Pretty sure that might be. Oh, that's the other airport. There's uh, there's another one up here, really close. Yeah, there's two airports. There's... We're gonna trim down just a little bit. Two airports pretty close. Uh, let's try to find four lane. I think we have the four lane over here. We're going to go down to Jellico, which is right on the line. Now, of course, I can't see the line from up here, but. Let's see, oh, I'm sorry, I need to be heading south.
I'm at 2,500 feet. I think Jellico Mount. See if we can find Jellico Mount. Might be this first one right here. This first mountain, Jellico Mount. Uh, Williamsburg or Jellico one? I think it was Jellico because I was reading. Oh, check that river out, man. It just hits those rocks right there at the base of this mountain and has to turn and come back up this way and go around again. Least resistance. One day that'll connect, but not today. Uh, Jellico Mountain, or is this Indian Mountain? Now I'm at. I'm gonna say Jellico Mountain. Oh, check this out. Check this out. You are kidding me. That looked like a bowl. I thought that was gonna be like a bowl. And I bet that pond fills up pretty quick when it rains. Okay, we're back to flying south. I've totally lost the damn foreland. I mean, that, that creek, that river is what's got me here. But I'm pretty certain. That if you were an interstate and you were coming down through here, you would, you would take this gap in the mountains. And that is probably the line. That's that's probably the line. I think we have Daniel Boone um, National Forest uh, to the west. Need to trim down again. You know what? This might be. Williamsburg. I'm going to say this is Williamsburg because it was bigger of the two, uh, bigger than Jellico. So the airport may have just been outside of Williamsburg a few miles, maybe. So we've got the high school just under the wingtip there. See the field, maybe. Baseball and... Do y'all have a water park? Seems like I remember you all having a water park. Uh, biggest waves in uh, Kentucky. <laughs> right there is the water park. I, I don't know, Splash Town. I don't know the name of it, but that's cool. And the, oh, these ball fields here. Yeah, there's the interstate. There's the interstate. Williamsburg got it going on. Y'all got a proper uh, track and everything. I mean, I ran track in school. We, we ran around the football field. Starting to uh, descend a little bit. Y'all got some tennis courts underneath me here. I'm seeing this. This got to be Williamsburg, town of about five thousand. Uh, it's much larger than my my hometown. Is that like a practice field and then the big field? A couple of practice fields, y'all. Wow. Okay, here's the water park. Ooh, and a major interchange here with, uh, love that park. So if, if I'm still north of the Jellicoe Mountain, 
Okay, we've got some factories. Uh, what well, looks like a truck stop right there at the interchange. Following the river down. Oh, maybe that's the Cumberland River. I, I, I don't know. I beg your pardon. I don't know. Uh, we got some forest roads over there. Big coal mining and uh, forestry was here in the 1800s, I think 1808 or something like that. 1808 is when it was settled, this area. And they had several schools out here, and I, I remember thinking when they combined all the schools into like one district, I don't remember when it was, 1836, I don't, I don't remember. One of the schools burnt down, and I was like, it's probably one of the Anderson boys that burnt it down. <laughs> oh, right down this valley, man. This, this is nice. Oh, we've got the uh, highway turning below us. Always good to follow roads if you can. That's what I liked about Williamsburg and why I, I uh, took off from there and not down south at uh, Jacksboro and came up 75. Uh, Williamsburg, I bet this is Jellico. Jellico, maybe, town of uh, about 3,000. Well, it, it's getting less. Uh, more people are leaving town. It's probably like my hometown. Kids are. Kids are graduating, joining the military, leaving, never coming back. Um, heading up north for jobs. Uh-oh, we got a broke down truck on the highway there. Uh, we ooh, looks like we got a train bridge and a highway bridge. So you all probably uh, have already uh, centralized your schools where we, we hadn't around here until recently. So a lot of people from Jellico, if this is Jellico again, I am assuming. So we've got the river, we've got the train tracks, we've got the highway system all comes through here. because it's a natural gap in the uh, in the terrain <laughs> and that is probably the highway that runs right up over into Virginia near Jenkins Jenkins Kentucky okay now I'm at 2,000 feet, and I think the Jellico Mountain would have been back that way. If I'm in Kentucky, uh, if I'm sorry, if I'm in Tennessee already. Oh, nice big open field here to land in, <clears throat> if we need to. Um, oh, I think I might see Walden's Ridge down there. Uh, commenter helped me identify some mountain ranges. And, and I really do, I really like to l learn about, uh, you know, other parts of our country, man. I worked for five years AT&T talking to people from all over the country. And <clears throat> Of course, I knew where they were because their address was on the screen. But, you know, I could just say, and I've traveled across the U.S. I've pissed in the Atlantic Ocean and pissed in the Pacific Ocean. So, 
you know, you just start talking about their their state or their their hometowns, and, and you get to feel a little, you know, a little bit more knowledge about about your country. And this is a big country. I know some people that live in country it takes you two hours to drive across. So look at this river the way it turns again. It's a must be a slow river. We've got uh, some um, mountain trails on that ridge line over there. Oh, I had some lag. Got some lag. Got some lag. Now we're either getting joined by another river or this one does some funky stuff here. Following seven. 75, sorry, following 75. There's a mountain there. Doesn't that look like a volcano that exploded, you know, three billion years ago? Just exploded this direction. I think we got Wallens Ridge. Walden's, Walden's Ridge. Uh, we have a prison around here called Wallens Ridge, so I may may mess up my... I see, I'm flying... South? Yeah, I'm flying due south. The 75 climb to the top of one of these hills? I thought it uh, went down this way. We're kind of getting back into, is this Carryville Cove? Cove Lake Recreation Area down here. I believe we might be back into Tennessee. I'm pretty sure that we are back into Tennessee. But what I like about Williamsburg, I tried to mention this earlier, um, I've set my radios to uh, 108, well, I thought it was 3, but it's not. I don't want to mess with anything while I'm traversing that. Oh, so no. No, the four lane does not run down through here. That's a nice little valley though, isn't it? Y'all go canoeing down through there? Man, I'm skimming across the top of these. Okay, um, I could be officially lost now. I lost the four lane. I know it's to the right though. I bet this is just deer hunting areas right here. Well, hell, they're probably down in the fields of a morning. Okay, we're heading northwest again. Does 75 take a, a sharp turn to the west? That is blowing my mind here. Um, I do this, this, and this. I need 108.3. Come on, come on. I need. Oh, damn it. 
Shit, I can't watch forever. I got mountains in front of me there. Yeah, I would have definitely hit that one. Yeah, it looks like everything kind of turned to the to the west right here. And it goes up the mountain. Boy, that's a great view. I, I'm assuming coming down uh, to look over into the valley. Damn, y'all got some shit over in here. Where the hell am I? <laughs> oh my god. I found a, a pond. I found a marsh. <laughs> found... Found a sandbar. Oh, this way, this way, this way. I'm not even going to do it. I'm not even going to do it. i got to turn my radios on. I need 108.3, please. Turn it on. Come on, baby. There we go. Got to look up. This will point me home. Williamsburg has a nav radio beacon right on the middle of its runway. Oh my god. It ain't working. Something ain't working. Airplane's clean. I need to get some altitude. I'm lost in the Cumberland Mountains. I think, yeah, I think that river, just following the river, right, take me right back to, oh, there's the interstate. I got the interstate off the nose. Why isn't my radios working? Is there a mountain blocking me? We're up to 2,500 feet. radio work. It's probably just a distance measuring. It isn't flipping one way or the other. I don't have malfunctions on, so I know it's not malfunctioning. So. It's a bug. One hundred eight point three, Bravo Yankee Lima, Williamsburg. I I, I kind of need to fly down seventy five. I need to. Uh, I need to hang out out here. Yeah, we're 
just following the river. I get. I'm gonna say this is a uh, logging, logging uh, trails, logging roads. And I guess uh, on out to the west is the Cumberland Plateau. Okay, we're getting back into Williamsburg. And the radio hasn't picked up yet. about got lost and I don't have a chart hey okay, there's the interstate That is a big mall. It's probably not that tall, but in real life, it's probably just one level. You're all schools, what's got me? Williamsburg School Lab. I like the way that, you know, there's just little neighborhoods tucked away inside these little valleys. You know, you go around this mountain and right there you're in another valley. You're in another neighborhood. I think I see the uh, airport off the nose. Ooh. We're just going to make a beeline for the runway. We're going to land runway, what was it? Three? Six? Runway six? Bravo Yankee Lima, one Alpha Bravo coming in for landing. Adding a flap. One more flap. We'll look over the nose. from the left hitting us. Ooh, I'm a little I'm a little far down the runway. It's okay, we can land short. And brakes on. Welcome back to Williamsburg, Whitley County Airport.
in Williamsburg, Kentucky. I hope you like this video. Leave a like, comment, subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Glad to be back home.